Yo, what's up, people? Welcome to the video. And I came across some Star Wars news, which is news to me. And I kind of wanted to share that because, you know, I like Star Wars as well. Uh, I saw it on the Bespin Bulletin. That's a site for Star Wars news. It was posted on October 13, and I wasn't really following it, but now I am. And I do want to share it, but um, Star Wars is having a Bring Home the Bounty campaign. And uh, in this campaign, they show off new toys, collectibles, books, and more. And for December the 14th, it seems to be having a game plan, which is awesome because I want a Star Wars game. I really want a Star Wars game. Um, this could mean like one, of, well, there's a possibility it's one of two, one of two games. Uh, one is a Ubisoft massive game. And the other one is a Quantic Dream game. And both are rumored to be open world games, which is also really amazing. Um, there's a few things though, like Ubisoft Massive is also working on an Avatar game, which is set to release in uh, somewhere around 2022. Don't know the date yet. Um, so that, that might be a conflict. Maybe there's a smaller team working on it already. Don't know, but it would be awesome to see that. Um, and Quantic Dream, I'm, I don't think they're developing anything right now. They just came out of a deal with Sony uh, for three games, and the last game was Detroit Become Human. So um, that's kind of done. I, I think they have uh, a lot of free time on their hands right now. <laughs> I'm not sure, but um, I'm not sure if that's actually a game coming, but I saw like a rumors on that might be possible a couple of weeks ago. So would be awesome. Um, I would love to see at least a Star Wars game from Ubisoft because uh, I just love Ubisoft. I might be alone, or might be not alone, but a minority in it. But I really love the Assassin's Creed games, one of my favorite franch franchises in gaming. Um, so seeing a game from Ubisoft would be really awesome. And from both studios i would kind of love to see what they would do in the universe of star wars um how are they gonna implement the the star wars universe and their vision is it going to be about jedis is it going to be about bounty hunters which are really popular since the mandalorian show which is freaking awesome though so i'm um, kind of wondering what it will be but uh uh quantic dream um i I'm curious about Quantic Dream because the last game they made was Detroit Become Human and before that Heavy Rain and oh my god I can't think of the other ones but um, they're pretty uh, story driven I've never played them though I'm gonna be honest I never played them but they're pretty story driven as far as I've seen uh, like uh, quick time events and everything and uh, in the rumor they said it's gonna be a more traditional game so uh, I'm kind of really curious in what they think is a traditional game and how they would how they would make it and just form form it, I guess, which is really amazing because I would love to roam around Star Wars uh, and just just see the world and uh, I'm kind of wondering though if it's going to be open world, it's going to be uh, uh, how do, how do you call it interplanetary? Okay, you space travel? It's just one big planet. I'm really curious about it. Um, so yeah, we just we just have to wait. It it could also be something else, which uh, if it's if it's like if it's I'm gonna be completely honest. If it's like a mobile game, uh, eh, I, I don't really care about that because I don't, don't play them. Um, yeah, but I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be uh, Lego Star Wars. Uh, Lego Star Wars just had a new trailer last month, I think um it's not going to be star wars hunters that's a free to play game for mobile and switch um which uh, also had a reveal about a month maybe a little bit longer ago um what's the other ones that we also got kotor remake just had a reveal so probably not going to be one of those and star wars jedi fallen order the sequel um i think they said that there's going to be more information in 2022 so um if it's now, awesome, but I'm pretty sure it's not not a, not sequel news from uh, from Respawn. So yeah, I'm kind of curious though. What will it be? 
I can't wait to see what it is though. Really amazing. More Star Wars, better stuff. I was looking around at bring uh, bring home the bounty, and I already like uh, we're at week two right now, and I already saw some pretty awesome things in there. Pretty expensive though, but pretty awesome. Like some Kyber crystal necklaces and some awesome toys from Mando and Groku um, in Baskar armor, but being um, like like Japanese uh, Ronin and stuff, which is really, it looks really freaking amazing. Really freaking amazing though. But yeah, kind of wonder what it's gonna be. If you have any idea, leave it in the comment section down below and uh, I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.